YouTube. It's Christine with Muscle Gauge Nutrition and Gauge Girl Training, bringing you a healthy whey protein recipe, which is great if you have a sweet tooth and you want to indulge in a nice treat from time to time, but still stay on track with your health and fitness goals. Now, this recipe was actually featured in Muscle and Fitness Hers, and it's a very simple yet easy and fun recipe to make. So all you need is some almonds, you need your whey protein isolate, I'm using Muscle Gauge Nutrition Pure Isolate. You need some Greek yogurt, some coconut butter, some unsweetened cocoa powder, and a zero calorie sweetener. I like to use sucralose, or you could also use stevia. Some baking cups, some mixing bowls, and a weighing scale. So the first step is we need to combine my whey protein with my Greek yogurt, have them together here in my bowl. Now the next step is I need to mix them up. So I got that all combined really nicely. The next step is you're gonna take four ounces of almonds. Now I like to purchase my almonds from Trader Joe's. I get them in single serve, one ounce almond packs like this. So all I'm going to do, I'm gonna take four of these and combine them in one bowl. All right, so now I've got my four ounces of almonds. I've got my protein coating topping. So the next step is we are going to take our Greek yogurt with the whey protein. We're gonna coat it on top of the almonds like such. So you should make sure that the almonds are coated evenly. And what you're going to end up with is something that looks like this. To take our Reynolds baking cups. Now this will yield six servings. This is what the treats should look like before they go in the freezer. This is part one. So this is before. We're going to freeze them for about five minutes. All right, so now while the coated protein bites are in the freezer solidifying, what we're going to do is we're going to make our drizzling chocolate sauce. And this chocolate sauce is really awesome because it is free of sugar and it's very simple yet very tasty. So I'm going to take my coconut butter. I'm going to take two tablespoons of this. We're going to microwave it. So I'm going to put two tablespoons in a microwave safe container like this. All right, so I have my coconut butter. It's out the microwave. So what I'm doing is I'm adding two tablespoons of the coconut powder, mixing it with the coconut butter that's already melted, combining two for our chocolate drizzle sauce. It's gonna to start to look like this. Now the last ingredient I'm going to add is our zero calorie sweetener. Now like I said, you can use stevia, but I prefer sucralose because it is sweeter tasting. Stevia is really good if you're looking for a natural sweetener. So I'm going to put a total of about three, four packets in here, depending on your taste buds, how you like things to taste. So what we have, once this is all combined together, is our chocolate sauce, zero calories, it's amazing. Now I'm going to take the cups out the freezer, drizzle them, and then we're going to put them back in the freezer. Alright, now you can see this is what they look like after they've been drizzled. Now they're going to go in the freezer. You can leave them in the freezer overnight or for a minimum of one hour until this solidifies.